Uh, meanwhile, we have to ask if Zinedine Zidane is thinking of a return to the dugout. This is what he's had to say on missing managing. He said, I'm busy in a different way. I miss the daily routine sometimes, even if the daily life of a manager is hectic. I took a break, which has become a big break, but sometimes I miss it. Hmm, Jules, what to make of this? <laughs> oh, we know he misses it. Of course he does. And he he took a long time to decide to become a coach. I mean, Frank will remember when he when they were playing together, there was no way that Zidane would become a manager. He he even said it himself that after his career, he went into other things, never thinking about becoming a manager. But little by little, as an assistant, then with the youngsters, then with the reserve, he really like found found his way into management and felt that that was for him. We know what he's waiting for, really, more than a club, because when you see it in Zidane, no offense, you don't go to Leicester City or you don't go to Middlesbrough, okay? Even, even for you. <laughs> we know what he wants. Here. He wants We've had to have been at me today for England, uh, now for Middlesbrough. I'm not sure I'm what I did to him tonight. I, I, I and you said he, you said he no, was your nothing, favorite nothing. as well, you know? <laughs> <laughs> but but I get your point France. here. He, that's the now, job that he wants. <laughs> yeah, that's the job he okay. wants. But no, he just he doesn't knows, know when you're available. And, and he knows you, Frank. And Frank might know a bit more about this. Um, well, you know, I tried to read in between the lines. Maybe Veronique, his wife, is fed up to see Zizou <laughs> at home, you know, 24-7, <laughs> and I say, go, go get a job, you know? <laughs> Leave me alone at some point. You know? Maybe it's that as well. I mean, I, I know that Zizou loves football, and football is his life. And, um, yeah, he can represent, um, you know, a brand somewhere there, somewhere uh, in another place in the world. But what he wants is to be somewhere, you know, on the on the pitch and uh, and get his guys and 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 train them and uh, and he feels it, he needs it, it's in his, it's in his blood. So I guess he's bored and he wants to get something, but he knows that he's not ready to sacrifice um, the way he's living his life for yeah for some locations where his family won't be happy. So it's a tricky decision that he has to make. We all know that he's waiting for, I would say, the end of July to maybe have a, a, a job as a, a national team coach, but he's not sure. And if he's not, he will have to find a club um, and, um, and he has to do it very soon because, yeah, we all know like Laurent Blanc, you know, hesitating to find a club wasn't a very good idea. You have to go back to uh, on the horse very, very quickly.